Um, yes, honey whiskey was the rest of it. Yeah. Well, the you thing are, that the thing that I find yeah. annoying is that now there's 55 flavors of whiskey. Like that's what mm-hmm. I find annoying. You get on the whiskey aisle, like getting a straight whiskey is like not even possible. It, you know what it reminds me of? It reminds me of the vodka aisle. Vodka aisle is just as bad. It is. And then you're looking and you're like, I don't know what to get. And then you you see some flashy bottle and you're like, ooh, that one looks good. And you take it home. You're like, I shouldn't have got the flashy bottle. No. And you know what's funny about the flashy <laughs> bottle is the vodka might be the best vodka in the world. But whatever the flavoring is, it's so artificial. Right. Sorry about talking with my mouth. Yep. No, I've been doing that the whole show. But no, the um, the flavoring mm-hmm. is just like. It's like if they took saccharin and they mixed it with crack and then they poured it inside the bottle. It's just not good. It's just well, not good. I like the ones that are like low calories and then they use like Splenda or Sweet and Low and it just hate them. like yeah, butt hole. Hate them. Yeah. Well, you see, it's so funny because I, since a young age, because my mom was and my sisters were big into artificial <laughs> I've been sweeteners. drinking since, I, since a young age. I've yeah, been. I was a child. I started early. <laughs> Early and off. <laughs> you got to start about early. Got to start 10 a.m. <laughs> at 7. 10 a.m. You woke up at what? 9.55 and you, uh-huh. that was your like morning coffee. Exactly. You just started well, out. Yeah. And I'm 7. Yeah. So like that's, that's pretty seven. much it. Oh, you should move to like Russia. Da. Da. <laughs> <laughs> I'm practicing. <laughs> trying to get better. So um, apparently... <laughs> Uh, no, when 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 I was a kid, uh, every every time they would hand me something, it would be fake this or fake that, like oh, like uh, duels or something like that. No, no, no. I'm not talking about alcohols. I'm talking about sweeteners. Oh. So like, I would be like, oh. oh, okay, can I have some sugar? And it'd be like, sure. Here's some mm-hmm. Splenda. That ain't sugar. Mm-mm. I'm like, oh, okay. Then you want the saccharin? No, I don't want that one either. Aspartame? No, no I don't want any of these. No. I want sugar. Sugar no. is sugar. Right. Oh, corn syrup. No, sugar. I like sugar. I'm, like, I'm a fan of sugar. Don't give me anything else. Right. Uh, same Nothing with else. fake oils. Have you ever had a Lestra by any chance? Oh, yes. Yes. Ooh. No, no, thank you. So probably about eight years ago, for people that don't know, the potato chip companies were trying to do what uh, Diet Coke did. So Diet mm-hmm. Coke got a million people hooked on Diet Coke mm. because you're going to lose weight. Nobody's losing weight on Diet Coke, by the way. Don't know why. Um, if you drink enough, you it gives you, it makes you go to the bathroom so you can lose weight that way. <laughs> yeah, but that's just water. <laughs> Let's be honest. <laughs> Every wrestler knows how to cut that weight. Like, seriously. <laughs> so, Olestra, they were like, okay, it's a fake oil. It doesn't get absorbed in the body correctly. So, everything's good. No problems. They send mm-hmm. out bags and bags of these chips. I don't think they did any testing because. Do you know what one of the side effects of Olestra is? The fake oil? Um, Think mm. something nasty, because that's what it is. Like anal leakage, anal leakage, anal, 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 anal leakage. Yes. <laughs> Thanks for watching this segment of the TP Show. 